In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to change to the classic workspace in AutoCAD 2026. Whether you're a seasoned professional who misses the old layout or a newcomer trying to navigate through different workspace settings, I'm here to guide you through this straightforward process step by step. This guide will help you switch to the AutoCAD, a classic workspace a setting that many find easier to work with due to its familiar interface and simplicity. All right, let's begin. First, you'll want to direct your attention to the menu bar at the top of your AutoCAD window. This area is where you'll find a variety of options that allow you to customize and adjust your workflow according to your needs. Look for the option labeled Tools. This menu is essential in AutoCAD, as it contains numerous functionalities that can make working on your projects more efficient and tailored to your preferences. Once you've clicked on Tools, a drop-down menu will appear with a range of options. From here, your next destination is the Workspaces option. Workspaces in AutoCAD organize your tool palettes, menus and toolbars, giving you a tailored environment to work in that best suits your workflow. By clicking on Workspaces, you're essentially accessing a menu that lets you toggle between different setups, each designed to provide an optimal experience based on what you're trying to accomplish. Now it's time to locate AutoCAD Classic from the list under Workspaces. This is the layout many users recognize from older versions of AutoCAD, cherished for its traditional setup. Selecting this option will transform your current interface into one that feels familiar and perhaps more comfortable if you're used to older layouts. The charm of the classic workspace lies in its simplicity and straightforward arrangement, which many users find increases productivity and minimizes distractions caused by more complex interfaces. Once you've clicked on AutoCAD Classic, You'll notice the immediate change in the layout. The toolbars, menus and palettes reorganize themselves to replicate the classic presentation of past AutoCAD releases. It's a testament to the adaptability of AutoCAD, how with just a few clicks it can adjust to meet the needs of a diverse range of users. And there you have it, you've successfully switched back to the AutoCAD classic layout. As you've seen, it's that simple. In just a few steps, you've customized your AutoCAD workspace to better fit your workflow preferences. This classic setup not only echoes familiarity, but also efficiency for those who enjoyed past versions of the software. Don't hesitate to explore further within the Workspaces menu, because AutoCAD is full of customization options that can truly enhance your experience and productivity. Thank you for joining me today, and I hope this guide has been helpful for you. Remember to subscribe for more helpful tips and tutorials on making the most out of your software tools.